ようこそ。What's up, guys? Kure here. I heard it would just release a Bleach trailer. For call free. If you're new here, welcome. But if you want to know my history of Bleach, I've been an OG Bleach fan since 2012 when I first watched it. Obviously, I was extremely disappointed when there was no Thousand Year Blood War anime ad adaptation. So that's why I went to read the manga, which ended around 2016. You know, we deserved an anime adaptation over the final season. Because I always think Bleach never gets the respect deserved, man. In my opinion, it's inspired a lot of the. Greatest new gen anime out there right now. The character archetype, the world, the themes, all of it is so reminiscent of Bleach and its style and what Bleach has introduced. But yeah, Bleach is my favorite anime, my favorite anime manga. Yeah, Kubo is top tier when it comes to presentation. In my opinion, I know a lot of people know like the blank backgrounds, but I think that enhances his art and it never gets the respect it deserves. Even now, but the amount of Inspiration that a lot of anime took from Bleach, but no, we really acknowledge it. It's a, such a shame, really. But I'm so grateful we still have, we have the new anime finally. And both Core One and Core Two have been amazing. So like, I'm not expecting anything less for Core Three. I hope in this trailer there's two things. One is I hope to show that one particular character. I don't want to say because I don't know if he's gonna pop up or not. And two, I hope the release date is actually much further than what we expected because a lot of us expecting spring. But I really hope it's further because the longer we wait, the more time they have, the better animation we get, the more staff they get. And both Core One and Core Two of Bleach compete with both Chainsaw Man and JJK Season Two, so it's like Bleach doesn't get no rest. <laughs> it has to compete with the best right now. But yeah, enough waffling. Let's just go straight into it. Bleach, Thousand Year Blood War. Always showing the blood. Got to. All right, yeah, left off with this. You have this Ichibe. I hope they expand that fight because that's towards the end they stopped abruptly. Oh, they're still alive, just spoilers. The royal squads. The royal guards, I mean. Okay, Ichigo seems pissed. That was Blue Vein, that's cool. So relevant, Shenzhen Maru. Yeah, it looks like Uri stops that. Like what we are all, I guess. Because of his ability, don't want to say. What was that? What's that? Oh my, they showed him. Oh, the full rig is ugly, like. Okay, okay, okay. There's a lot to unpack there. They showed so many frames of couch and you go back. Okay, coming 2024, there's actually no release date. What the hell? No release mode for a season. That's surprising, but that's a good thing. All right, let me go back. Yep, let's hope we get expansion of that fight. And that'll be the first episode as well. So normally first episode is like one of the best budget. This is kind of spoilery because each goes find you hard. So I love anime only can kind of guess who won that fight between you and Ichibe. So the actually quite confident here though. She didn't look worried or concerned. So I wonder how this is going to play out. Most likely an antithesis of his ability. Oh wait, wait. Okay, this Kuraku scene looks like his interaction with Chair Summer. <laughs> what is it? What is it? Oh my god, that's a Mimihagi. Oh my god, they're really teasing that. The effects looks really good for Mimihagi. Okay, Ichigo Ryatsu, gold. Nice. Jeez. <laughs> Guy's sitting on the chair, man. Guy's sitting on his throne. <laughs> now, that's sick. And obviously, where is he? There's a boy, Grimjaw. Grimjaw and Nell need to have a bigger part in the story because they don't have enough screen time in a manga. So I really hope they have a much bigger role to play. Especially Grimjaw. Grimjaw is one of my favorite man. He's actually one of my favorite Bleach fans ever. His character stereotype has been inspired so many shows. Just look at I mean, Baro, um, Sukuna. They all have the same voice actor as well. Ironic. That shot of eyes and looks clean. That is clean. The amount of Instagram edits is gonna happen because of eyes and appearance and core free. It's gonna be crazy. <laughs> Bro, that's 100% that's my thumbnail. But that's a sick shot. It's pretty cool with this because it's not really spoilery for anime only. For obviously manga readers, we can tell who it is. Okay, Ichigo versus Yuha. Hopefully that's a big fight. Now to run it back after that disrespect of the first fight. I do hope they give bigger roles to not just Grim Darnell, but also the full bringers we know as manga readers that they don't, they don't do much, they don't even fight. They've been teasing Grimjaw as well, more than a manga. Like, they've been teasing every single core up to now, so he needs to have a big role. Do you know how sick it would be if, if Ichigo and Grimjaw tag teamed fighting someone? I don't know, if even you are, that would be an epic fight. Like, the dynamic between Grimjaw and Ichigo would be 
actually sick to see. But yeah, no release date, which is good, because you know, the longer we wait, the better animation we get. But what's also good as well, we probably expect another trailer that will announce a release date. Um, but yes, until that time comes, bye. Yare, yare.